In the midst of the civil rights movement, race car driver Wendell Scott never took his foot off the gas. Despite being barred from racing at certain speedways, Scott was the first black driver in NASCAR and the first to win a race at the sport's highest level. The Virginia native learned to be an auto mechanic from his father and opened his own shop after serving in World War II. In 1953, Scott persuaded a NASCAR official to grant him a license. Ten years later, despite blatant discrimination, death threats, and financial hardships, Scott won a cup race. To this day, he is still the only black driver to win in NASCAR's top series. In 1973, Scott's career came to a screeching halt because of injuries in a 24-car crash. He drove until he couldn't drive any longer, flying into victory lane, breaking barriers in the process.